Alrighty, yo, what is going on guys? Declan here, and today I've got another video for you guys. So today I'm going to be showing you how to uh, enable transparency in VirtualBox. I made a video of this, but apparently some things have changed in the updates. So let's go ahead and uh, make a virtual machine here really quick. Um, just go through this all, it doesn't really matter. Um, so once it's made, you want to go into your settings. The first thing you want to do is go to your display, enable 2D, or enable 3D, enable 2D, 2D, and put this slider all the way up to its max so that the transparency will actually work and has enough video memory for it to work um, once we get into the operating system. And then you also want to mount your ISO. And now we will install Windows. Okay, so now that we have Windows all installed, let's go ahead and maximize this a bit. So once we have Windows installed, uh, we'll want to go ahead and go to the corner in Devices and insert guest efficiency, just like you would do install on any other normal operating system. Uh, so let's go ahead and go into Computer and right click and install Media. Go ahead and click Yes because we know it's it's probably safe. Um, go ahead and click next next until you get to the list where it says what features to install. This is where you want to um, here. This is where you want to go ahead and check Direct 3D support. And when it asks you would you like to install Basic 3D support instead, you want to click No and click OK. This way, it actually installs Direct 3D support. Whereas if you click Yes, uh, it says uh, in safe mode, so 3D support cannot be installed. Um, so you want to go ahead and click no and then you want to go ahead and install guest editions. And then once you get this prompt you want to go ahead and reboot. And then once it reboots uh, we should be able to enable transparency so we'll see. All right, and as you can see, Guest Editions has installed because of the resolution adjustment um, instead of it being that little box. So once you're in, you want to go ahead and right click, go into personalization uh, so that you can change the theme and uh, go ahead and click on Windows 7. And you will see that transparency does indeed work. Uh, so let's change it to this. Um, and then you know you can change your background to here and you can see that the windows are transparent so that's just a little update video showing you how to uh, enable transparency on Windows 7 and this is VirtualBox version 5.1.10 so if there's any update that uh, changes this once again go ahead and leave it in the comments below and I will try to make another video but that's it for now. Like this if you liked it, dislike this if you don't like it, leave a comment down below, suggestions, or if you want to comment. And last but not least, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.